Okay, today is a quick video because I wanted to get something out for my fellow video star editors. Also, there is a typhoon currently. Literally, the power has been out since 10 p.m. last night and it is currently like 10 a.m. the next day. So if you hear any background noise, it's the wind and the rain. I'm sorry. Today I'm going to be showing you how to get a Twixter effect on Video Star. Now, granted that the first clip I have in the example edit isn't amazingly smooth, it's simply because I am literally on a time crunch, okay? I barely have any battery on my computer, so I'm like trying to get this done, okay? These are methods that work for animated clips specifically. So yeah, with animated clips, it's really going to be hard to get like a smooth, you know, like flow and clip on here because it's, you know, Video Star is really, really good, but when you're working with mobile apps, in general it's going to be hard to compact the abilities of certain aspects that you would do on a computer onto phone but nonetheless i still think it's doable i'm not sure if this method works for real clips this is just specifically for animated clips as far as i know i also got these two methods from this account and although they didn't create the method or anything i just want to give credit to where i saw it from so the first one i want to show you is better with animated clips that have more movement and then the second method i'm going to show you is just for like basic um twixter inspired like slow-mo i hope that makes sense so let's start with the first one okay so start off with your clip go to motion from motion we're going to scroll all the way to forward and then move the circle all the way to the other end so it'll be at 4.0 and then just click apply now once we're back at the main screen um, we're gonna click velocity make sure that your style is on better mixture or fast mixture and then i'm just gonna move the green bar down a little bit now the thing is when you're working with this since we put on the forward effect the clip is kind of like going over and over it's repeating so make sure that when you move the green bar you're moving it low enough to where it's not repeating the same clip over and over now for the second method we're going to go to velocity make sure that the style is on nearest frames and then move the green bar up a little bit i'm going to put it about there but you can put it wherever you want. And then we're gonna click done. After that, we're gonna go back into velocity, change the style to better or faster mixture. It doesn't matter which one you do. And then move the green bar down a little bit. And then there we go. I feel like you can't really tell the differences. I just want to do a tutorial for animated Twixter um, effect because, because we all like to edit some animated series, whether it's like games or just shows. I know people love to edit Miraculous Ladybug, even though I literally despise that show because they lead you on and it's been so many years and they still haven't gotten together, but it's fine. But yeah. I feel like this wasn't a very like helpful <laughs> tutorial. Um, it's unfortunate. Sorry if it wasn't. 